Whoa. Oh, you, you can burn stuff for me. Oh, oh no. Oh no. I'm sorry, Mr. Coffee. How am I supposed to know what is alive and what isn't? What's up guys and welcome back to Little Inferno and I have to say after last episode I am so invested in this game now like the story is just it's really weird it's creepy a lot of people noted that last episode was creepy and I just have no idea what is going on I've been coming up with a lot of theories but right now we have some things to burn including all these damn spiders they always come out of nowhere so what do we get we have a blowfish Ooh, he just kind of floats there that's cool, okay, and we have, um, I think this is China, and we have some little buggy beetles. We'll throw them in there. I like to put everything in there at once, and we got some cereal. Okay, so we're just gonna give you guys a quick light. There you go, you you, you can go, whoop. Wait, why'd that go down? <laughs> okay, gather all this money, yeah. Oh wow, why is it burning red? My fire's different. That's weird. Hello, neighbor. Yeah, Sugar Pumps is our neighbor. What? Are you still there? You're reading all my letters. I thought that was gonna say lettuce. <laughs> really carefully, right? You're not just skipping through them and burning them up, are you? One day I might say something really important. P.S. I ordered you something. Are you ready? It arrives today down your chimney. You, you got me curtains? I can't, I can't burn the curtains? Why did she give me curtains? Oh, I guess, I guess she's gonna answer now because I'm very confused. <laughs> All this, I love you can throw the crap around, it just breaks up. Uh, Sugar Plumps, what? Do you like your curtains? They're so pretty. There's nothing like a well-decorated home, but don't worry, they are fireproof. Love, Sugar Plumps. Well, Sugar Plumps, I'm not sure if curtains um, really have a place in a fireplace, but you know what? I'm still gonna burn your letter anyway, and I'll thank her for them. You know what? I appreciate it. What else have we got? Discount sushi pairs well with a nice bag of wine. A bag of wine. Future Fizz feels great as long as you keep drinking. A toy exterminator protects your crops using all natural pesticides like napalm. Ooh, that one sounds exciting. And coffee. It's coffee time. A lot of people are theorizing what's going on in the comments, which is good because I don't mind theorizing with people because I don't know, you guys don't know. It's fun to discuss the game together. And uh, a lot of people were saying, you know, maybe, maybe the earth is cold because of the fireplaces. Like it, it's a reverse, like we're using fireplaces to stay warm because of the cold and the cold is getting worse because of the fireplaces, which is making us use the fireplaces more, which actually does make sense. I mean, some people didn't really get it because they thought, you know, pollution, global warming, that would make it warmer, not colder, but that that's not the case. You know, it's not, it's not so much global warming as it is climate change. And that's actually happened like in recent history. Like if you, if a volcano puts a ton of ash into the atmosphere or for instance, a lot of fireplaces, then it blocks out the sun and the sun can't penetrate and it can't warm up the earth. And this has happened like in the last 200 years. I think there was a time in Russia when it didn't, it snowed, summer didn't come for like a couple of years, which is, whoa, cool. Which is kind of crazy when you think about it. Where are those little flies in the cans? What? That's really weird. Okay, well, you you are gonna be intense. I wanna burn you by yourself. Can you just, I'm just gonna... Whoa. Oh, you, you can burn stuff for me. Oh, oh no, oh no. I'm sorry, Mr. Coffee. How am I supposed to know what is alive and what isn't? The marshmallows still haunt my dreams. Please don't be alive. Midlife crisis mitigator. Drink two glasses before bedtime, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Sounds good. An egg pack. Free range genetically modified chickens provide the most colorful eggs. Mystery seasoning. Uh, season the hors d'oeuvres at your next masked ball. That's weird. And locust eggs. For the daring gourmand? I just love like beating stuff around while I'm waiting. I edited it all out for you guys because I mean just sitting here waiting for stuff to tick down is no fun to watch but like just whacking stuff off stuff and seeing it explode burning spiders. It's always a ton of fun. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? We have wine. Are you gonna are you gonna be alive? You're probably gonna pop. Hey, okay. That, that was a kind of cool I guess. Um, we got eggs. Egg, egg, egg. What, what could this possibly do? I guess they must pop. 
Eh, it's kind of uneventful. And then we have whatever this is. This is what the catalog is actually uh, designed after, right? Whoa. Did you see that? There was like a ton of bacteria or something like that. That was weird. Can I, can I break you? I can break you. I got a letter. Ew. I saw a bug. Ah. Gawk. Hey, will you send me whack? Send me an exterminator. Okay, thanks. Okay, so you want me to buy you another exterminator? I kind of want to burn another exterminator. Oh, boy. Sorry, sugar plumps. We got it? Okay, so now we can send you this. Have fun. Message sent. And that's one thing, like, I'm theorizing so much, like, I, I can understand that we're burning stuff, we're trying to stay warm, but who these characters are, because I'm apparently a child playing with this, and I'm burning stuff, fine, whatever. But, like, where are my parents? Who's Miss Nancy? So, am I, like, am I an orphan? And would that make Sugar Pumps an orphan? Does she live above me? Or are we some kind of, like, heating slaves? Like, we all work in this one big building making heat for everybody. It's really interesting to kind of just think of what the hell is going on. Thank you for the exterminator. He's perfect. Ready for exterminator. Let's get that bug. One, two, dot, 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 three. Ha 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 ha, blam, 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 blam. Oops, I missed. Oh, there's the little bug. Come here, little beetle buddy. Okay, we're friends now. Lick, 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 ha ha ha, he loves me? I don't think beetles can lick. Smooch. Aw, oh, he laid an egg. Okay, you can have it. You got a bug friend. Um... Do I, ooh! Little bug friend. Oh no! Was I supposed to, are you Are you guys okay? Little bug friend. Am I supposed to be using these guys with something? I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave them over here for now. So we have a toaster. We're gonna burn this over here away from our little bug friends. And we have a mushroom. That's, that's a very weird combination. Oh, it's full of spores. Spores and toast. No toast, I'm so sorry. Oh my god, I love the little faces on things though. God, that is cool. Okay, there's a double fan combo, and I think it might be the space heater and the metal heart. So I'm gonna get them and try because we need to wait for this stuff to like load up anyway. And then little bugs get them out of here. I'm gonna burn one. How about that? We'll just burn one. What, what do you do? You, you gonna do anything? Miss, Mr. Bug? No, you're kind of uneventful. Okay, so. I, I I don't know if I was supposed to use these or anything or not. Whoops! I'm afraid that there's gonna be a lot of secrets in this game. And I, I, I might miss them. And if I do, I apologize for that. But I mean, that's kind of the nature of the game. Ooh, they seem to be doing something together. They're they're like, yeah! They're like, they're reacting to one another. This is blowing out and, and into that. Cool. Breaking weather report. Forecast says, Fewy, smoky with gack. <laughs> Smoky with a chance of thick gack. Nasal discharge, ha ha ha, hack, hack. Chimney smoke and smokestacks as far as the eye can see. Hee hee, ga ha he. Reporting from the weather balloon over the smokestacks, over the heek city, the weatherman. Okay, well, we're getting more shitty weather reports. That's interesting. Okay, well, we can burn our juicer in this, right? What are you gonna do, juicer? I feel like I should put you over here so that I can see... Oh, you're not doing anything. Oh, I could have probably put stuff in the juicer and juiced it. That would have been cool. What the hell are these? Why Why do I have a bunch of, like, little raccoon things? I didn't buy these. What else do we have ordered? It takes so long for stuff to show up now, I don't even remember. A uh, smoke detector. That, that'll be useful. Oh, that's, that's a sound that I just... Doesn't everybody just love that sound? Oh. Hey, stop that. Stop, stop, stop that. I need I need you to burn. I don't I don't want the water. I never even thought that might happen. Stop, stop, stop. Just 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 die. Just go peacefully into the darkness. <laughs> I think it's done. So there's another combo called Dynomite, and we have dynamite and a dinosaur. It's kind of a dinosaur, not really. That that might work. And then we have watching you, time bomb, lol kitty. Well, lol kitty probably involves the kitty kitty poo poo, but what would the lol part be? 
Oh, man. You see, so, some of these are going to be a little bit more difficult than you would imagine. Maybe it would be the, the snake surprise, because that makes you laugh. Maybe we'll try that. The snake surprise. I don't think that's it. And the kitty plushie. If it doesn't work, we can always hope for the best, right? Okay, so we want to try you. I'm going to put you in first, because if, if I lay this guy down a little bit too hard. Right? Okay, good. Last time I dropped him, he just popped. Yeah, dynamite. Whoa. <laughs> I think the elf is probably my favorite one yet. He is so freaking cool. Okay, are you going to be the kitty kitty poo poo or the, uh, no. What was it? The, the lol kitty? Because it's a joke thing and, oh no, that, was, that wasn't that was it. I thought that was it because they both explode and they both let stuff out. Man, that was my first combo that I screwed up. Damn. Oh, there's a catfish combo. So maybe we need the blowfish and uh, and another kitty kitty poo poo. Oh, it's on cooldown. Damn it. Okay, so that that's definitely one. And what else do we need? That's a catfish bear in a china shop combo. Okay, so that would be the bear and uh, the fragile china. Makes sense. So we have, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we have a bear in a china shop, right? So we put the bear, we put the china shop. That's, yeah, okay, there's a combo. We can get a couple of things out of that, nice. And we got the blowfish and the kitty. Yeah, the catfish combo. Okay, finally, kitty, kitty, poo, poo. You're, you're pulling your poo, poo weight. There's one called Time Bomb. Would that be the mini nuke and the clock, perhaps? Would that make sense? So that would be, and then dinnerware combo. What would dinnerware be? Uh, we don't have anything here for dinnerware. I think we have, no, nothing there either. What would dinnerware be? Yeah, we have, we have a wooden spoon. Would it be, would it be the wooden spoon in the china? Doesn't seem very dinnerware-y. I guess we give it a try. So we have a clock and we have a bomb, right? Oh no, I don't, okay, was it? Yeah, time bomb combo. Oh God, hit the deck. Ah. <laughs> oh man, the explosions in this game are so satisfying. I just love it. And I, I don't imagine that this is gonna be it, but we might get lucky. Yeah, dinnerware combo. Okay, I'm underestimating myself. You know what? I know what I'm at. And I think there was another one that I figured out as well. There's, um, okay, there's Easter bunny. That'd be the bunny and the eggs. And there's iced coffee. So that would be the coffee and the dry ice. So dry ice, coffee, uh, eggs, and the bunny. Get, we're getting there. We're doing really well. Look at the brick textures around the outside. I don't, didn't remember it looking that good. Maybe I just never paid attention to it. Okay, we got the, oh God, you again. Okay, here's here's your eggs. Have a, have a good time, have fun. Here you go, here's your eggs. <laughs> God, that's terrifying. I had to use that as a thumbnail for last episode because it was so, such a cool little picture. And no, no, don't don't tell me that doesn't count now. Don't tell me, I just, oh, I just broke it. How, how do you break a coffee cup? Okay, let's try that again, but this time ever so carefully, right? Ooh, that's cool. It actually freezes stuff. I didn't know that. Please work, please work. Oh, come on, you're, you're frozen. I can't, I can't burn you. Yeah, oh God, I'm sorry, coffee. It had to be done for the combo. The worst part is his little, his little dead eye and screaming mouth just stays there. Oh God, okay, there's another one that I found out that was uh, corn flakes. So we have, we have flakes and we have corn, right? So now we can, we can put our cereal here. Ooh, that's freaky. Could you imagine waking up in the morning and trying to eat that for breakfast as a kid? Terrifying. Okay, here's your corn, corn flakes. Okay, there we go. Okay, I think we're good. I think we have enough for the, um, for the next catalog maybe? Yeah, new catalog. Ooh, the first person shopper. We can get Tetris blocks, otherwise known as tet Tetronimos? Tetronimos, Tetronimos. Why can't I pronounce this? Tetronimus, Tetronimos? They've been falling for as long as anyone can remember. It's actually interesting. Somebody pointed out the other day that Tetris, every block is every possible orientation of four cubes. I had no idea. I've been playing Tetris my whole life. I never realized that they are all made up of four cubes. It's crazy. Uh, imitation Meat Boy tastes like cardboard. Giant spider, a giant spider appears. Temp flee giant spider. Oh, I'm gonna love burning you giant spider. A uh, cell phone automatically uh, shortens all words into three characters or less lol. 99% 90, sure that's a tooth. 
<laughs> so we have some Tetris blocks. Oh my god, there's so many. Do, 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 do. Okay, you know what? I, I can't. I can't spend the entire episode trying to trying to organize these. And you, you can go on the top, and then <laughs> Mr. Meat Boy, and then you know what? The calculator just go in the pile as well. <laughs> and we got a letter. Who wants sandwich? Me, a sandwich, sorry, me. And you know what else? A bazillion of years ago when billion and trillions of little particles spewed into the cosmos, entire galaxies formed like a snowballs. And distant stars and suns caught on fire. And after billions of years and billions of miles and a teensy number of particles all got stuck together and created you and me and a little wall right between us. I think it's a little ceiling. They, it seems impossible, but it did happen, and they also created this mm, delicious ham sandwich. Mm, um. <laughs> Thank you for your salty cosmic particles, Mr. Pig Squ Okay, I thought she was thanking me for my salty cosmic particles. Like, whoa, this just got PG-13. <laughs> You taste like progress. Okay, sugar plumps, PG-13, just keep it there. From your neighbor, sugar plumps nom sandwich. Okay, that's thanks, thanks sugar plumps. The boss plushie, no one suspects the slick businessman was the villain the whole time. Yeah, nobody would ever expect that. A toy zombie, you can make a game without one of these, or you can't make a game without one of these. Handheld fireplace, it's like a game with a game within a game. I like it. And uh, we have a pixel pack. More pixels means more fun. That is true. The more pixels, the better game is. That fire is really raging, man. Those Tetris blocks, they burn well. Okay, Mr. Boss, you're, yeah, you can go over here, see? I'm gonna burn, I'm gonna burn the tip of your finger. You're just gonna, you're just gonna eat it up. Oh, God. It's slowly consuming you, boss. Are you just gonna sit there and accept it? Get thrown against the wall. Oh, I should have seen if the zombie would eat him. Yeah, here, play Game Boy. It's just gonna slowly approach you. Oh no! Oh! Oh, it was the same. It was the. It was like a pixelized version. Not a pixelized, digitalized version of the uh, the 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 commercial song. That was kind of cool. Okay, we're getting so much money to buy more stuff. It's awesome. A phoenix egg. That is gonna be cool. Gentleman adventurer doll. An adventurer to find the best looking suit in the world. Puzzling. No. A cardboard sword, take this, it's dangerous outside. And goo ball pack. The goo balls seem to remember one another. Uh, a world of goo, but it was a very long time ago. Oh, that's right. I think they made some kind of goo related game before this. So maybe that's what it's a reference to. I don't know, I never played it. Phoenix egg is gonna be cool. I wanna... Neat. Okay, sounded a little more like a phoenix feathered raptor, but that's okay. Okay, get in there, gentlemen. I'm gonna put you on your. Okay, let's let's just give you a sword. Give you a cardboard sword. Where where did all the gems come from? That was so intense. We have a letter as well, but I'm gonna burn whatever this last thing is first. Oh yeah, the goo balls. They don't they don't stick to anything. What's the point? I thought this was gonna be interesting. They're just little balls. Ah, burn. <laughs> okay, what's what does our letter say? I need some more. I need some more story. I'm typing you letters, and I don't have a delete button. It fell off. But you know what? I love more than anything. Blank pages. They can be filled with anything. Dinosaurs or outer space or an entire world where everything is pink. The possibilities go forward forever, but can't ever go back. Love, sugar plumps. P.S. You can have this. You've got the delete button. Yay. Should I... My my delete button doesn't do anything. Should I keep that? So far, everything Sugar Plumps has given me is just been something for me to burn and get a bunch of money from, so I'm just gonna assume that this is something that I don't desperately need. Like, the Miss Nancy coupon might be important, but I think if I burn this, this should give me like 20 or 30 coins, maybe? Damn, that's a, that's a strong delete button. I can't I can't take it back. 
17 coins. Okay, that's pretty good. You know what? I think I'm gonna end this episode of Little Inferno here, guys, because it takes quite a while to burn all of this stuff and to get through the catalogs. We didn't really get a lot of story this time. I'm actually a little bit disappointed. I kind of wanted to... I would skip over a lot of the burning and try to get to more story to kind of compact the episodes, but at the same time, I know a lot of people enjoy the gameplay, and I really do enjoy it too. It's funny seeing all of these things interact with one another, so I guess I'm just gonna have to kind of wait. I'm more interested in the story. I'm really interested in learning what's happening, who I am, who Sugar Plumps is, who Miss Nancy is, what's going on in our world, why we're burning all this stuff the way that we are beyond to stay warm, and what that thing in the fireplace is. There's so many unanswered questions, so I'm really looking forward to playing more Little Inferno, and hopefully you guys are as invested as I am. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Yeah, chicken eight. So I get to see, oh, your eyes aren't yellow. Interesting, so the cats keep their eyes, they just, whoa. I, what? That was cool.